Namaste, good morning. Namaste, Shamla Didi. Namaste, everyone. Welcome to the morning session. Ji, Namaste, Sunil Ji. Sabhi ko Namaste. Good morning and welcome. Ji, we can start. I think there are two sharings today. Is that Ji. right? Ji, there are two sharings today. One by uh, Patmavadi Didi and another by HR Arvind Bhaiya. Ji. So we, yeah, we start with uh, Patmavadi Didi. Namaste, Didi. Am I audible, sir? Ah, now you are audible. Okay, thank you. I am Padmavati from Chalapati yeah, Institute of... Briefly introduce you and then you can uh, share your, uh, uh, your ah. learnings from uh, using this uh, indicators. Okay, within 20 yes, minutes. Very briefly yes, introduce you. Dr. Okay, okay. Yeah, Dr. Padmavati Gauri Parthiji. She is yes, an associate sir. professor in uh, Chalapati Institute of Engineering and Technology, Gundur, Andhra Pradesh. She associated with this UHV activities from 2021, and she attended the UHV uh, workshops in 2021 and 22. Yeah. With this brief introduction, okay. I welcome Patmavadi Didi for her sharing. Didi, please uh, confine your sharing within 20 minutes. Over to you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much for giving this opportunity. I feel so happy as a part of this uh, FDP programs. Uh, regularly, I attended all these sessions uh, based on my time constraints and availability given by management also. Uh, I am very lucky to share my feelings today in the fresh morning. On behalf of my sharings, UHV program values was absolute knowledge importing and immense worthy, where I became aware about reality and the true meanings of various terms we most often use and experience throughout my life. Essence of happiness, prosperity, justice, trust, respect, health, self-regulation, and moreover, many more I realized and explored intensely. It naturally modified and regulated my thought, processing, and import on my way of living. With improved understanding and gradual upgrading in knowledge, my thoughts are now streamed and without any external influence, I'm able to take my right decisions, enjoying happiness. I'm also experiencing that this right understanding in me is being acknowledged and appreciated in all around, in my family and balance ending of workplace in my college. Earlier, contributions and efforts towards family and job were making me a little bit stressed and tired. And at the end, I was getting all waste as nobody was acknowledging those efforts which I was extending for them, only in my opinion. But after the workshop, I evaluated and observed that Whatever I am contributing is preferably for my own sake, for my family, for my profession, and ultimately for my happiness and nothing. I'm doing for others. And truly, after this realization, I started enjoying my work without any complaint, stress, and complications. It not only helped me to overcome my stresses, but also strengthened relationship with my family members and colleagues, which were earlier a little bit painful. It, I realized and provided stability in my decision makings, and now I am self-regulated in my thoughts, behavior, and actions also. It also brought the workshop a great difference in teaching my core subject. Earlier, I was dealing nature as a separate entity and a connection was missing. But after this workshop, I recognized fulfilling relationship with nature. And now I interacting with and dealing with nature also. I am able to connect myself and my students as a unit of entire existence. It became a very easy to visualize and understand now that for our sustenance, sustenance we are facilitated through so many things 
organizations available in nature and the protection and conservation of all these things organisms is actually for our own survival so it's our responsibility to make arrangements for judicious need based use of all these not exploitation as happening nowadays in absence of the right understanding we are aware about our role and participation as a unit of this great nature though through this holistic approach we are becoming more honest accountable and responsible one and moreover what i am going to share on behalf of nature after doing this first and second workshop i learned that looking into the self is very important one should observe oneself and determine things which give happiness when one is faced with a question of whether one should carry out an action and how it would affect oneself and others it is uh, possible to determine the answer by going through a process of natural acceptance it uh, involves asking oneself and then evaluation one sections natural acceptance is a powerful tool in my opinion and i can refer very through though it to it empowers me to decide actions for myself and then verify the effects of carrying out them out this can be done without referring to an external source of books instruments or some other persons the external source may be initiated point but ultimately it is me who has examine and decide based on my own authority natural acceptance using natural acceptance one is able to discuss life goals and the stuff fit without taking about what one should do and what one should not do um, instead of padmavati ji so um, after um, mom mom please yeah. could you go by the step you know the pointers that are given on the screen okay. if you can see on the screen okay. go by those pointers yes and yes if you can give some of your real life examples of what you okay. have understood okay okay coming to the exercise one uh, the great understanding between me and other people who are interacting with me before the workshop i feel some aggressive and uh, i'm not able to understand what i am and after this workshop i realized a lot how i am balance it and understanding the relationship how should i maintain balance it workshop based on harmony in and around people and specifically to my students and colleagues also after that i realized what my mistakes based on that and coming to the next point it is a very important to ensure coexistence and otherwise i am not able to balance it my health issues also it is very important to note that what i am able to understand relationship harmony coexistence in each and every people in and around who are living with one family and others also and Uh, i change a lot my style of teaching also after this workshop so, so this workshop i suggested and i request the authorities implement this subject as a core subject apart from technical but subjects but technical but subjects what you have got from the exercise are you if you can see these steps in front of you okay you looking at your imagination are you the, the what the steps are mentioned here if you can go by that that will okay. be more okay okay, okay. so uh, after this workshop uh, based on this exercise what i i feel is it these are more important and uh, personally we want to coexistence about all these all these things based on it is not important to note what i am able to understand relationship with other people and uh, my sincere request to all the authorities uh, please introduce this subject as one of the uh, core subject as for the engineering students 
then only they want to understand what we are and what uh, we want to give to the society also uh, and uh, uh, moreover uh, some something else situation based on we try to understand other other person's feelings also and uh, moreover give the respect to the other people and we are human beings always we extend our service to other people and we want to give the service from others also i am so thankful to a part of this uh, um, great session and this is what i observed from this workshop thank you very much for giving me this opportunity and further also weekly programs and uh, like this workshops i wish to continue my efforts uh, to know more and more human values um, based on human conduct and existence nature and particularly self realization thank you very much for giving this wonderful opportunity further i wish to learn more more and more things on behalf of these workshops thank you vananda ji padmavati ji i just wanted to ask you a couple of questions um yes, in the yes, exercises sir. one and two were you able to okay. look at your imagination were you able to look at your thoughts yes before this workshop i i am not able to understand what i am uh, self realization after this mm -hmm. workshop i realized I, a lot no i am asking you are you able to observe your imagination yes ma'am are ma you able to observe when you are thinking are you able to observe your thoughts are you able to observe something is going on inside you all the time okay ma'am yes ma'am i have i have said ma'am but i am not able to realize before the workshop after this workshop i realized uh, what i am from my side what are the mixes mistakes done on behalf of my lack of awareness could you um, also comment about your um, commitment yes yeah uh, Uh, yeah, um, based on the situation, I try to balance it my mindset and give the best to my students community. And uh, balancing the mindset is very very important. That's what I, I observed from this. The in the last point on commitment. Okay, commitment. Question, how much time can you devote for developing right understanding, right feeling, and how much time can you devote for social responsibility? social uh, developing right understanding uh, based on the situation ma'am uh, um, i do i i i try to do level best um, based on the development of the right understanding and uh, more of our social coming to social responsibility uh, some uh, sometimes it happens natural calamities like this uh, what the situation happens in uh, maybe a misunderstanding how much uh -huh. time can you devote like these 2 hours we are spending in the english session okay. and, and we are trying to develop our understanding isn't it so like okay. this are you able to spend time during the day uh, and do in say in doing activities for social work in terms of volunteering activities are you able to do something of that that is okay. the question okay so coming to the understanding development in writing understanding and help the social responsibility point of view uh, based on the situation and the time zone as i'm working in private organization uh, so other than uh, our college schedule i try to uh, help the people as a citizen of this great country uh, word and deed definitely i want to spend my time uh, Uh, for the understanding of the near and dear ones not only for that what the happening uh, in and around throughout our country all the 29 states like uh, Man manipur inc incident we know all are uh, aware of that is also a social responsibility what i feel uh, based on the incident whatever wa in what extent i am able to help the people who are uh, in that need definitely i want to focus uh, based on this and uh, yes, after this workshop kind of i really did those kind of conditions we may not be able to do that much but okay. right now there is a volunteering opportunity in front of you okay for spreading this awareness helping others uh, you are yes. saying you need to do okay um, 
are you able to with all your other responsibilities take time out to volunteer if so okay. you can give your name and somebody can help you to yes on whatever time is available to you yes help you to volunteer so that two okay. benefits of that is one is you are doing your social responsibility so you are helping in the process okay. or uh, understanding of others and the okay. second thing is you are very close to the content so when you are okay. close to the content it helps you to reflect more and more on it and okay. helps you to further your understanding so okay ma'am it is useful yes, so that question i just wanted to ask you do you have time available to you would you like to volunteer in any of the activities that are going on it could be not necessarily during the time of the workshop it could be when you are say at your home there are some translation works there are some other works since yes, the sir. work is expanding at a large scale Yes, so um there are many things that need to be done like there okay. is right now whatever is being shared okay. that is being recorded there are some uh, people who are video editing and putting up these you know some of the videos and so on so many many tasks okay ma'am definitely i will do and your time one. availability okay madam i will yeah. uh... text message uh, and definitely i want to volunteer what sort of works i am able to do and uh, definitely i want to involve thank you so much for the giving this opportunity to ask uh, volunteer work also i am ready to do any sort of work what i am able to do definitely ma'am definitely bhavati ji i think uh, this is the first time uh, you are attending the morning session isn't yes, it yes ma'am yes ma'am yeah. yeah and you attended the um, uhv2 workshop one time two times ma'am one time only i got the certificate uh, to second time some sessions uh, i was uh, missed due to lack of uh, facilities uh, more about uh, networking two times yes. i attended yes so nice that you are able to connect to some of the proposals and you are able to see uh, a change like you mentioned in okay your behavior and other people have noticed you mentioned it okay. would be nice uh, next time perhaps in your sharing if yes. you can include specific examples okay. that will be very useful because others are also able to relate to that see okay definitely the other thing is if you can do the exercise 1 and 2 step by step in a okay. little more depth and uh, we are going to be doing the exercises one more time exercise 1 and 2 after this batch is over over okay from the end of august we will be starting that batch so okay. i would really urge you to continue to be with the morning sessions and okay. uh, go through the exercise 1 and 2 in a little more depth so okay, that is more useful to you you will find okay. it uh, very very useful yeah okay ma'am definitely nice. definitely ma'am very nice and for the volunteering activity you can there is a google sheet uh, if you contact any of the tech team they will let you know about it and you can fill up that sheet okay and depending on your okay. skill and your time availability it can be okay. matched for you okay right yes ma'am yes ma'am nice definitely. very nice all the very best to you for your thank further you. exploration okay thank you so much ma'am thank you thank you all thank you yeah thank you patmavadi didi for the sharing thank you sir um, and thank you thank you shamla didi for the remarks and comments regarding didi sharing now uh, before we move on to the next co explorer for his sharing there are a couple of hands raised so we can take up the questions uh, to patmavadi didi maybe uh, srinivas gupta ji namaste uh, namaste daya uh, namaste to all my co explorers Namaste, sir. Pramila Didi. Uh, namaste, Padmavati Didi. Uh, nice Ma'am. sharing from you. Uh, namaste, sir. Uh, I namaste. would like to just uh, ask one question. Uh, uh, yes, you, sir. You said uh, you are able to understand and the feeling of relationships and uh, all those. So yes. while you interact with the people of any level, if you narrate with uh, one or two incidents, then that must be more uh, uh, 
clarity you can understand from your understanding if you yes, narrate it, any incidents one or two at least just i would like to know okay incidents in the sense uh, regarding as a teacher uh, based on my students uh, mindset i try to uh, educate the values of human life sometimes uh, students are behaving in a very uh, naughty manner and uh, misconduct uh, doing some mistakes then i will uh, personally explain what is the life of values of our life how you are behaving like that your parents are uh, efforts uh, giving more efforts on behalf of your education so you if you are behaving like this uh, what is your career like that i in not in front of all the class uh, students personally i call the students particularly who are uh, behaving in a anti social um, manner then i want to educate and uh, explain in person uh, after some times uh, they will uh, change a little bit this is my efforts based on uh, universal human values session what i learned and uh, give the uh, i mean uh, uh, mentoring my students point of view this is what uh, my personal experience very recently few days back regarding final year uh, students uh, who are behaving in a very naughty manner i'm not able to tolerate them but uh, a little time i uh, myself controlling myself and patiently explained in the classroom overall and particularly i called out the students and educated them in a very um, uh, uh, i mean what they are how they are turning up how they changed their nature this is the bitter experience very recently happens in my institution sir this is what uh, yeah, we are changing Behavior in them, did he? Have you observed changing behavior in them through? Ah, uh, some little bit, sir. Not, uh, not totally. Little bit yeah. only. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. Ji, thank you, Srinivas Gupta ji, for that question, and Padmavat Didi for the response. Okay. Padmavat Didi. Uh, yeah. Thank you. We have uh, one more uh, hand raised. So okay. Sir. That, uh, in the chat box, if you can see, uh, there are. volunteers from your stage uh, okay, requesting to get your number for example vasundi vasudi did is there okay and, sir jagdish uh, babu bhai there are many other volunteers from your state who okay. would like to add you to the volunteering team okay so you can share your number in the chat box they can okay. access that and they will be contacting you definitely sir i will yeah and now we have a question from uh, prashant bhai namaste prashant ji जर्नल and we have to note down at least one of the activity in one hour sharing by all or by ma'am also or everybody anybody whatever you are getting in one hour so how it was useful in this last four months do you know the concept of the journal didi i think it was <laughs> uh, you are not uh, done this have prepared the journal because i had i am also beginner like you padmavati didi you got my question so anyway it was a nice sharing but i what what i found um, because i heard her uh, right from the beginning um, uh, and as uh, rightly told by sharimla didi she nicely uh, explained um, so whatever we the, the main purpose of the sharing is that what we have understood during this last four months what are the changes particularly to the points which are given so it was not there so sorry to say like that we all are so i am helping her to increase her competency that's all from my side yeah okay yes thank you. i'm trying to do this as as if i am the uhv journey maker or volunteer so i should say the right if we are putting our journal 
um, I'm having my 25 to 30 pages during this last four months, whatever it may be, but it helps while sharing, we can see that we can uh, see to go through that points examples which are given by Sharimila Didi or Kumar Bhaiya, and these are all helpful to we all people uh, for the further journey in the UH life. Jibaya, namaste. Uh, yeah. This is my sharing for today. This was the question. Thank you. Thank Jibaya, namaste. You. Namaste. Thank you. That's a very nice point. Thank you so much. So uh, we will uh, move on to the next sharing today. Uh, Arvind Priya, Namaste. Namaste ji. Namaste. Okay. Namaste. So I will briefly introduce you and you can give your sharing within 20 minutes time. So Dr. HR Arvind ji is an assistant professor in the Department of Mathematics, Cambridge Institute of Technology, Bangalore. He attended the uh, introductory UHP workshop in May 2021 and UHP 2 workshop in August 2022. And he uh, started attending the morning session from the sixth batch onwards and uh, also active in the volunteering activities. He's doing the registration part of the online workshops. So with this brief introduction, I uh, welcome Arabinji for his uh, sharing in the morning session. Yeah, the indicators are there in front of you. Please go ahead. Over to you. Thank you. Yeah, th uh, thank you, Baya. Uh, thank you, Sharmila Didi. Uh, as introduced by uh, Sunil, uh, Sunil Kumarji, I am Arvind, uh, assistant professor working in Department of Mathematics, uh, Cambridge Institute of Technology. I am living with my mother, uh, my mother and uh, my wife. <clears throat> She is also working in the same institute in the Department of Physics. And my son is studying in 10th standard and my daughter is studying in uh, third standard. See, I want to uh, tell the three major changes uh, when I attended the UHV1, UHV2, and after attending these uh, morning sessions. When I attended the UHV1, I thought that the content is go good but uh, applying it practically it may be difficult i thought like that so but when i went to the uh, second uh, level uh, uh, uhv2 face to face fdp in andhra so that time i just uh, i came to know that this uh, this content has to be applicable to me so before that i was expecting i am exp i am applying to the i am seeing whether the others are following it or not after the second face-to-face uh, -face FTP, I came to know that so I have to leave according to this content. And these morning sessions uh, are helping me to, uh, means that it's like a guiding force. No, I am not going away uh, or distracting myself. Uh, uh, means I am going in a right direction. So th this is about the three things. Uh, and uh, these morning sessions are helping me to connect to the content explore the proposals and improve my understanding. Uh, so and regarding the uh, uh, these point, pointers, uh, uh, I'll try to put up like this. So I'm able to observe the myself, what is my desire, thought, and expectation in most of the moments. The feeling of relationship is uh, natural to me and I want its continuity. See, whenever I am uh, I'm in harmony in the self, I'll work for the uh, to improve the competence of the other, which will ensure the harmony within the family and myself in all other interactions. Whenever I, I feel unhappy or disturbed, I will, I will explore the reason. Is this uh, due to the assumptions or the imagination? I am able to see the feeling of relationship is naturally acceptable to me. The feeling of relationship making me to act accordingly in the family, at workplace, in all other interaction. The basis of decision making has to be right understanding, which will ensure the happiness and the harmony in the self. So I'll just give the, some of the examples which where I have changed. <clears throat> so during morning sessions, I'll go for a morning walk, 5.30 to 6.30. So after morning walk, I will uh, I'll bring the uh, milk and I'll go to kitchen and I'll give it to my wife. And also I will ask her for a glass of water. Immediately she will ask me to stand there only to collect the glass of water. 
So at that time, I'll, I'm, uh, I am thinking why she, why she could not come to the living area to give me, a, uh, give me water where I am sitting on the sofa. So by, the, uh, by, beha- by this behavior of her, I used to get disturbed or uh, disturbed. And I used to get the feeling of the opposition about her. Then I thought that in- instead of disturbing her, I will, I will only take water and drink. Now I am taking water on my own and I am happy and there is no feeling of the opposition. And I am not disturbing her because she has to prepare the breakfast and lunch for us as well as for the children. Now the, uh, now the level of understanding has improved which is leading to the mutual happiness also. From the November, uh, from when I joined this uh, sixth batch, I am I am trying to reduce and I am able to reduce my weight by around 10 to 12 kgs. So I put up more, so I wanted to reduce it. So many people have recognized that and have reduced uh, reduced that uh, means whatever I have reduced in the family also in the workplace also. My wife started complaining me about that you have time to do the exercise and able to reduce your weight. That is, you can go for a walking or you can go for swimming also. But I do not have, she was complaining it. See, earlier I used to react, it means you won't give, uh, I used to react with her. But because of this, after uh, going through these activities, with the feeling of the relationship, now I am helping her to reduce her weight by bringing the suitable vegetables. And uh, in the evening, we'll go to the same college while returning to the home. I will drop uh, her three kilometers prior to our home so that she'll, she will walk for some time in the evening, so the, which will help her in uh, reducing her weight, uh, weight and also keeping the health. The importance of the feeling, feeling of relationship making me to act differently than which is, uh, which is making us both of us happy. So in the last sharing, I have shared that I used to talk, stop talking to the many of others in order to teach them a lesson. Uh, now I can understand this, uh, this attitude of mine make me unhappy rather than the other. Now I am making efforts to improve my understanding, also make efforts in continuing the conversation with the others. So regarding the eating habits, I used to eat a lot, whichever I feel uh, tastier. Now I am able to understand that how much I needed and I am not uh, tempted by the taste. So I, I am aware that if I am in harmony within myself, I will interact with the others in a more meaning, meaningful manner and I will respond to the situation and the people rather than the reacting it. I am able to see that, see that most of my decisions based on the understanding. And in that workplace, I am finding different way, ways to convey the information to the higher ups instead of uh, de- instead of depending on the previous experiences. If, uh, if higher ups all- allocate some other work to me, I will do that work if the time permits, or instead of pointing the mistakes of the higher ups, I will suggest that so-and-so faculty has the better information about this. You can allocate this work to them. And during the morning sessions itself, whenever some, someone shares or someone questions uh, their understanding or their reflections, and if they tend to prolong it, prolong it continuously, if they prolong it, I used to get irrit- irritated. Uh, then I thought that it is no, uh, then why, why this irritation is coming at? And even sometimes I used to remove my earphones also. So then I thought that this is the, uh, this irritation is entirely up to me, whether I want to get that irritation or not to have that irritation. Then I changed. Now I will not get, if someone talks for uh, 10 minutes or 15 minutes, I will not uh, uh, get that irritation part. Means uh, the decision making has to be me, means it all depends upon only me. me. And many times I used to do the work with the feeling of the compulsion. Which will, which will make me unhappy. 
even the morning uh, doing puja also i used to do get that because sometimes i uh, do it with a force like uh, i used to have some sort of feeling it uh, means compulsion now i understand that uh, to keep the the right feeling is it's entirely up to me it is not dependent on the others or the situation so one day i asked one question to kumar bhaiya in monthly meeting uh it is uh, means uh, somebody may take the advantage of our, ourselves means they will exploit us at that time i was expecting the answer that uh, he will say that the uh, the others are wrong when bhaiya told that uh, prior to that you you might have had some program which my which made them others to exploit you at that time i was not happy with that so happy with the answer because instead of i was focusing to get a particular answer rather than knowing what is the exactly the answer later on again again i just uh, uh, means i just gone through the same problem and i try to change my program so if somebody is exploiting me so how can i uh, change my program i changed it and now i am feeling it nobody is exploiting me uh, i means so they'll also behave in a mutually a uh, uh, fulfilling manner and uh, the i am able to understand the self and the body and how to use the body through the instruction of the self and most of the time i am deciding based on the right understanding in the self than the sensation so this uh, i can observe that in my interacts this i can observe in my interactions with the other i will listen to the others and then i will respond and i keep feelings right which will make me uh, which will make me to respond it and one more thing i used to i take food at a particular time earlier i expect the food should be ready by the time i used to get upset if the food is not ready but now i am able to wait until the food will be ready without any unhappiness or the disturbance i am able to observe that i am the one who is reading the sensation and i can distance my, myself from the body like the coldness of the water means if in the winter season coldness uh, if i feel that it is too cold it is too cold it is not means not and also taste of the food means uh, by by depending upon the taste and taste of the food i am not taking much if it is tastier also i'll take how much i need it now whenever i like uh, i take food i am taking the food in order to nurture my body and not for the uh, for the taste so i and one more thing the major thing i used to interact only with a few people whom i like based on their behavior likes and dislikes and i used to maintain the distance from the many others so this distancing from, from many others will make me unhappy so therefore i can understand that feeling of relationship is the uh, will ensure the my happiness as well as the mutually also so this is the major change that i have i am able i have observed in myself and i tend to write down my observation based on the others ref- reflection um i want to devote more time especially morning sessions i'll continue to attend it and some of the weekly meeting i attend uh, have attended uh, and uh, i am taking the uhv classes for the higher sem- in the second year students which is also helping me to go through the this content and the proposals presently i, w- I am involved in the regist- registration process and also i have joined the canada translation team uh, lalita didi is guiding us to translate in the translation work and especially uh, in colleges we do act- activities for the students earlier with a feeling of oppositions uh, the atmosphere opposition i was not uh, keen in uh, involving in more activities now uh, with the feeling of the relationship i'll take more uh, student activities activities either uh, those activities may not be compulsory for me to take it on my own i have planned a, uh uh means a group called plugging event the next saturday we are going to conduct a plugging event which is an awareness program for the people who will moving in the highways 
highways means when when they go in car bus people will throw the plastic paper water bottle outside the highways so this plogging event uh, will we will make us uh, will clean the uh, that is sides of a highway and also will make it as an awareness program for this one and i will want to continue this event as a for every uh, twice in a semester so that students also get the awareness so in this way i want to contribute to the society it's my duty so with this uh, i thank sharmila didi kumar bhaiya uh, sunil bhaiya tara prasanna ji and other co explorers uh, thank you thank you one and all thank you arvind ji very nice sharing i would say lot of examples are there with which uh, many of us are also connected to thank you so much yeah so uh, dear co explorers we can now uh, ask questions to uh, arvind ji specific questions your appreciation can be put on the chat box yeah we have uh, srinivas gupta ji again namaste srinivas ji yeah namaste bhaiya namaste sunil ji namaste my co explorers namaste arvind ji namaste ji uh, yeah you have narrated nicely the counter examples uh, what you have experienced and uh, i would like to know more on uh, your understanding about uh, all the orders in the nature how do you uh, it your uh, self uh, for protecting the nature you have given one example you are plugging up uh, the uh, along with the students you are doing that and any other examples you can put towards the protecting nature or your contribution towards the nature or your Because understanding did... uh, about uh, its of nature yeah yeah uh, see the one thing is that uh, we wanted to change our furniture especially so far uh, means we want to update it then i thought that anyhow it is good we can use it so i don't want it to change. means if we go for an upgradation again we will exploit the nature that is one thing and uh, recently we uh, last uh, i think uh, recently we cultivated a paddy in our native also in there uh, many of them they used this uh, uh, that is weed remover which is a cancerous thing means which will give the cancer in order to uh, remove the weed they will use some pesticides like that and i don't know what is the name but when it came they suggested me also you can avoid the labor also but i uh, I, i didn't use it i didn't use but uh, we with the use of the people only we did it uh, this is what this is what i can and one more thing i will carry the bag uh, for the vegetables and i will tell my uh, who are going whenever we will go will i want, i will tell them to carry a bag we will avoid the plastic ba- bags also even in the shops also i will tell in a such a way that you can offer some uh, means you can ask the who are people coming to the uh, uh, stores say that uh, please bring a uh, bag like that i'll t- do these things a very nice way i don't know thank you very much i'm able to understand thank you yeah thank you, thank you. yeah thank you srinivas ji now uh, there are plenty of hands raised before we go to the uh, co explorers and their questions uh, let me request shamla didi to give her uh, comments and sh- uh, remarks re- regarding arvind ji sharing shamla didi over to you namaste arvind ji namaste didi nice to hear you sharing today um i think in a short span of time you have been able to imbibe some of the proposals and able to see um some changes in your life which you have mentioned very nicely in your simple day to day examples it is the small things i think that we start with and we may not um be able to do many big things to begin with but if we can see the significance of what we are learning what we are you know the proposals that are coming before us and we can apply it in our day to day life slowly we can start seeing the changes and the people around us also see those changes and most importantly our happiness quotient seems to be increasing as we do this so very nice to hear uh, your sharing 
perhaps um, uh, and and the fact that you are already doing a lot of volunteering in fact we have noticed that when we volunteer we our exploration seems to deepen and go at a faster level because we are close to the content and we keep listening to the content reflecting on it so uh, that and our interaction with others that becomes are uh, like a laboratory so i have to look within myself and i have to see my interaction with others so i am only that laboratory and everything that's happening around me is part of my testing area so all opportunities that we get help us to grow at a faster level because when we are aware we are constantly checking ourselves so very nice to hear you and all the very best i think um, in the future sessions also we'll be seeing you there as we go yeah, further thank you there yeah as we go further of course this exercises it is a lifetime of work so we start with some things we are able to note and then as we keep doing this again and again the exercises we realize there is so much more to learn there is so much more that we don't know and there is so much more that we need to explore and check within so um, of course i would invite you for the next session also and onwards and uh, all the very best to you for your further exploration also yeah thank you devi thank you yeah thank you shambla didi for the comments and remarks regarding arvind ji sharing uh, now uh, before we go to the questions of the co explorers narej ji is there ganesh ji is there devi prasad misra ji is there so before that let me make a few announcements uh, the sharing is going on in the morning session so many dates are still open for sharing any co explorers uh, did not give their name so far the experience sharing in the morning session is helpful as we have two sharings today uh, to understand what where we stand in the uh, exercises as well as uh, in the understanding part uhv3 and helping others also to uh, strengthen their self exploration part so uh, tomorrow we have sharing by sopan ji and uh, maithili ji and day after tomorrow we have only one sharing by ruby ruby didi and in august you can see main dates are open so please give your name for sharing if you did not give it so far now another announcement is uh, from 31st onwards we have uh, this uhv1 online ftp the message has been gone to many uh, of the co explorers the uh, principals of many colleges but now the message is available in the chat box also so this is a five day online uhv1 program ftp program which is uh, enabling the teachers to or orienting the teachers or the faculty members to uh, offer this uhv1 as part of this sip the student selection program which is going to come sooner than later so um, eligibility is uh, introductory uhv introductory ftp certificate of that is is required for this uh, there are three workshops announced one is from 31st july to 4th august in english and second is 7th august to 11th august in hindi and third one is 21st to 25th of august again in english so you can register and you can help others also to register by passing this message to your colleagues and other institutions around you yeah so with this few announcements let us move on to uh the questions by the co explorers yeah naresh kumar ji namaste ha uh, namaskar sir namaste meri awaaz aa rahi hai sir yes uh, sharing of uh, arvind bhaiya is very good and he is doing excellent work to the nature and uh, the student will be encouraged nowadays i am thinking that most of the engineering graduates or the youth are uh, want to only do the jobs white color jobs they do not want to go to the even the sites and they do not want to do physical work 
and it is very unfortunate 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 to the nature and to the community also and i am feeling at site uh, in the work uh, the new commerce officers want to sit in the office and they do know, uh, they want to work at computer only i am from the civil side most of the work is done at site but youth are reluctant to go to the site and he is doing the work for the uh, for nature and the students are encouraged very good i appreciate thank you sir yeah thank you arish kumar ji for those comments um now we uh, move on to ganesh ji ganesh ji uh, over to you hello namaste sunil bhaiya am i audible yes, bhaiya yes you're audible namaste you're audible, um, audible. नमस्ते शर्मिला दीदी नमस्ते अरुण जी नमस्ते माय ऑल फ्रेंड्स भैया आई हैव टू क्वेश्चंस वन क्वेश्चन यू फील दैट समबडी इज मिसयूजिंग यू और योर सिंप्लिसिटी यू आर एक्सप्लोइटेड फॉर एग्जांपल सो देन व्हाट टाइप ऑफ प्रोग्राम यू टेक वन क्वेश्चन एनी एनी वन एग्जांपल भैया give at least one example that yes that happened now i am doing other type of program not to get exploited second question is that uh, what is the improvement you have observed especially in the family especially with your wife uh, okay father mother yeah, yeah. these these two yeah. questions bhaiya yeah, please uh especially why we people will uh, exploit means uh, somebody will take advantage of us ha huh, that is so correct we we yeah we, uh, we tend to follow their uh, instructions means we okay. tend to uh, uh, fulfill their needs means we always uh, make them happy again and again and again mm -hmm. so you we, we need to know when to say no also sometimes whatever what you feel what is your uh, what is your importance what is needed uh, more because of we follow them we try to uh, make them happy yeah, they continue to get that feel so that is why we they'll try to exploit it so if we know where to stop it so then uh, they will also respect our feeling otherwise uh, anyhow he is uh, he is there for me like that they'll th think it that is very very good uh, but sometimes what happens <laughs> you can't say your boss say the uh, ac academic sort like that in the university or the college if you so sometimes no, you can't say no that is the problem the answer you have given that there is a limit you must say at one time that no not possible but they cannot say that is the problem so program any other program be a special especially it is saying only no or other way because we want that not to get them also disturb in my behavior sometimes that has to be taken care Uh, all the feelings with all feelings feelings always be there because uh, with good relationship uh, whatever disease and whatever program we do follow that to be so bhaiya any any program like uh, other things is there can you mention that uh, any example no i i never encountered this with the higher up i just uh, i i had this experience with the my fellow colleagues ha uh, colleagues uh, okay. you can can yeah. can see but sometimes even you know if you are a good good people calling so so sometimes they to what are you doing now then <laughs> that 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 happens uh, sometimes uh, because uh, if i am not able to satisfy or you say please bhaiya i will try my best but not at present i am uh, doing lot of jobs so what jobs then you are doing like that sometimes not all <laughs> but people that they are like okay um, so you have not encountered that with your boss that that problem happens whenever it is your boss actually na so this happens uh, sometimes they say i am we, we are not going to listen 
Ah, uh, this is required. You have to do. I can't say when you do. And they, they, they say directly that uh, uh, you have to do that. Uh, how you see? I cannot uh, listen. There, there is no time or like that. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, thank you, Bhaiya. And second question, Bhaiya. The, see, in the second you... question, uh, I, what I will do? Mm -hmm. See, if there is a disturbance, there is an unhappiness. Mm -hmm. I will try to improve my my participation. Ah, ah, ah. If you keep on changing your wife, your son, your daughter, ah, what will ah, happen? It ah. it won't. It is not at all possible. Only Got thing it. is that we if we are participation. See, ma'am uh, means uh, gents it's have more opportunities. Movie. They'll go out. They'll uh, they'll go with the friends. They have many opportunities. Whereas the when it comes to the women they have a limited uh, exposure outside so when we tend to go out and all do means we get that refreshment part we have more mm -hmm. means what i can think we we have to improve our uh, participation level so that uh, yeah. uh, instead of questioning them or blaming them if we mm -hmm. if is it anything i am able to do so that she will also be happy if i think yeah. like that uh, mm -hmm. It will they solve it. If we try mm -hmm. to change them, they will try to change us. No. It won't uh, come to a solution. Mm -hmm. That is what I have seen. Acha. Tick tick. Ajay, by any example that happened with your wife like that, and you have seen that there, there is a lot of now changes. You get this was what the only thing because I have I went up to 98 kg, kgs then I started working I reduced I I just yeah. came to almost uh, 10 years before how I was so they in the college mm. also everybody appreciates mm. she also she the by looking that uh, their other appreciation itself she got irritated see so you mm -hmm. have time you are you are going for swimming also uh, mm. in the evening. So you are getting all the opportunities, but I don't have it. So mm -hmm. instead of, uh, that is true also. But if mm -hmm. I react to her, she is not, uh, she is not uh -huh. feeling happy for me. So Correct. instead of that, I just told that you take some uh, vegetables in the morning, this type of vegetables. Mm -hmm. And uh, mm -hmm. morning she can't come for walking. So I will mm -hmm. drop her around three kilometers prior no, to I my heard. house. So mm -hmm. she will work in the, these things. Means ah. we have no, to good. make them also um, ah. understand something like. And you are yeah, now yeah, yeah, like, watered by yourself. You give the example. Okay, very good. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Bhaiya. All the all the best. Uh, you are in good good line. I think that you are exploring lot. Very good. Thank you, Bhaiya. Yeah, yeah. Thank uh, you. Yeah. Namaste, Sunilji. It's okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, Ganeshi, for those questions and nice responses by Arvindji also. So, uh, the time is uh, closing towards the Hindi session. We will briefly take the question of uh, Devi Prasanji also. Devi Prasanji, Namaste. Namaste, Bhaiya. Namaste to all. My question is already answered. So, please. Ah, okay. Thank you. So, thank you all, dear colleagues, for us for your participation in the uh, English part of the morning session.